For whatsoever is born of God, yes, overcometh the world. You overcome the world if you are born of God. Now, how many of us have been become, watch out, you have become born again, but you haven't overcome the world yet. I mean, you don't have to say amen on that. I, I happen to know a little stuff. But the Bible just said, whatsoever is born of God overcometh the world. I wonder if he's saying you have overcome or you will overcome. Can't be both. Huh? You have. You have. You have. A, that's why I'm telling you, victory must happen during the storm. Amen. Not waiting for the storm to be over. Because if that's the case, what do you need victory for? What do you need the Lord for if you can just stand yourself and hold on until the weight and the mess get off? Those trees fall, saints, because they have no root. It rained and rained and rained, but there are certain trees don't shake. Lord, I wish somebody would have heard that. So I don't care what kind of phallus thing followed some of you all, it don't move you. Does it hurt? Yes. Do you know it's there? Yes. And, and listen, let's say, now here with you, John 15. I want you to see what God is saying here. Now watch what the words that you, I mean, listen to the words that he's going to read here in John 16. And you're going to see why God was so, he, 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 it looked like he just always had something to say about you better get your strength. You better know I'm with you. Listen, listen. You better hear what I say to you. Because trouble is just around the bend. Hell is just around the corner. And it's like, you ever seen a world get messed up so fast that you've seen the one that we're in? This world has gotten so messed up until if you are not sanctified, purified, godly, all of what God told us to be, we got trouble. He said, these are the things that I'm saying to you to let you know when it comes, you'll know I told you so. And this is what I'm preaching to you today. Don't get excited about what trouble is because God got you in his hand. But you're going to trust God somewhere. 